Salomon Speedcross 6, new generation of uh, trail running shoes, released at the end of 2022. So I uh, used them for a, a couple of runs, for about, I don't know, about 20 kilometers, and have uh, some opinion about them. I don't see they change that much from the previous generation. Uh, they have new vibrant color schemes. I've chosen this one, even though this white top probably gonna be dirty right away, very, very soon, but still, I like this color scheme. Uh, b before I always uh, had black ones. Uh, for the colors here, by the way, in Canada only five colors are available in the USA. There are seven color options. This one is not available in Canada and this one is not available in Canada. I took this one and there is also black and gray. This is what outsole look uh, like. That's when they were brand new. And this is the kind of weather we have now. So uh, what I think about uh, those uh, Salomon Speedcross 6 trail running shoes, uh, the, uh, the change that I noticed that the front part of the shoe became uh, like uh, there is more, much more room inside. Like I feel like maybe there is a, a bit less cushioning and they became, my feeling they became a little bit higher and a little bit wider. So that your, your toes, they can move uh, left, right and up. I'm not yet sure if it's a great thing, like it feels unusual, it feels not the same. Also, I think the side walls, uh, they made more hard so that uh, they can protect, protect you better from uh, hitting the uh, rocks and the branches when you run and roots of the trees. So far I was running on packed snow. This is how we roll in Canada. Uh, in April still trails are covered with snow. So that's what I think, like uh, pretty much uh, very alike to the previous generation, but it seems like a front part of the shoe has more room for toes, better protection on the side walls. Other than that, uh, shoes are very similar. Outsole is almost identical. I compared with my previous shoes and all the rest, like even design, is very similar. So if you're choosing between Speedcross 5 and Speedcross 6, there's not much difference. Like uh, I would probably go for Speedcross 5 uh, since they're cheaper now. Don't get me wrong though, I'm still a big fan of those uh, shoes. I think that uh, Salomon Speedcross is, uh, for me, is the best trail running shoe. 